Good morning. It's Friday, December 11. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ and to the faith for which it stands, one Savior, eternal, with mercy and grace for all. All right. We make our beginning in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our reading is from Luke 2, verse 8. And in the same region there were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over their flocks by night. Page 163. Next week we will sing three verses. Light one candle for all, one bright candle for all. He brings hope to every heart. He comes, he comes. Light one candle for peace, one bright candle for peace. He brings peace to every heart. He comes, he comes. Christmas time is here. Time when the sounds of carols ring through the air. A time to gather together and remember the true meaning. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? I can tell you what Christmas is all about. By Caesar's request, Joseph and Mary went to the town of Bethlehem to register. The time came for Mary to have her baby. There was no vacancy at the inn. So Mary wrapped the baby with cloths and laid him in a box where the angels are fed. Where the angels, where the animals are fed. Hmm. There were shepherds in the field keeping watch over the flock by, flocks by night. The angel came and said, "Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be to all the people." Long ago, God the Father made a promise. God promised to send a Savior. The promise of the Savior came true. One day, an angel came to visit Mary. The angel said, you will have a baby. The baby will be God's son. You will name the baby Jesus. Joseph took Mary to be his wife. An order came to be counted. Joseph and Mary traveled to Bethlehem. There was no place to stay in Bethlehem. There were shepherds out in the field. Luke 2, 8. We fold our hands and bow our heads. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this new day. We thank you for the weekend ahead of us. Though it may be rainy, we know you will be with us and grant us rest and peace. Please be with everybody who is affected by um, COVID. Let them get better and help it to end. Be with our families, Lord, and all the prayers we have in our hearts. It's in Jesus' name that we pray. Amen. <laughs>